Okay, so to get a publication ready for commercial printing, uh, we need to follow uh, two steps. Uh, one is outlining the font, and number two, embedding the images. I'm going to show you how to do this using Illustrator. Um, if it's a different program, um, uh, follow equivalent steps. Uh, in our experience, embedding the fonts in the image uh, in the in design file doesn't work so well. So if you use Publisher, which offers the option of embedding the fonts, first um, export as PDF and then follow the steps using Illustrator. Um, otherwise, it's going to come out broken. Um, so uh, it's fairly simple. Um, open up the, uh, the, the file you are working on using Illustrator. Then make sure this uh, the selection tool is chosen. And then hit um, Select All. And uh, you, if you use your mouse drag, it might not work so well. So use the shortcut. It's Control A. So just hit Control A, and you'll see that everything is chosen. And uh, we need to do two things. Uh, first, is outlining the, the fonts. And I can do this by going to the menu and then hitting Type, and then selecting Create Outlines. This menu. The, p the exact position of the side end will vary depending on the version but uh, just look around for it. Once you create the outline, you'll see that the fonts became uh, vector images and you can't edit them anymore. So it became fixed and now the design will save the shape of the font as opposed to the font text itself. Let's go back one step how it was before. Before this was editable. You can double click and add because it's, it's text, it's, it's not an image. And if you don't have the fonts, we run that prom. It, oops, we run into that prom. So uh, outline everything. And then after it's outlined, open up the links tab. So this will likely not be there. But go to window uh, and then open up the links tab. That's again uh, links. So window links, menu window links, um, and there, if you have selected everything, all the uh, images that you have inserted will be in here. So click this little uh, little menu on the right. Oops. Click this little menu on the right and select embed image, and then all the images they will have this little new icon next to them, which means they're embedded. So select embed image while everything's chosen. And now this file will be much bigger than it usually was. We recommend saving as an EPS or an AI file, either of mine, um, because it will have both the fonts as a vector image and also the um, embedded in the image themselves will be inside the same file. So it, it will go from being a 50 kilobyte file to 1, 10, 20 megabytes. But that's the file we need to print them correctly uh, under commercial printing. Otherwise, the fonts are going to break. We're not going to get the, we're going to get pixelated images. So please do that. Thanks.